Right, to, to prepare garlic root tips for mitosis, we're going to cut off one centimeter from the growing end of the tips of five little roots and putting them into a glass block. I'm dropping them in there. So you get several tips. I've got more than five. I've got quite a few there. Okay. And we're going to um, put hydrochloric acid onto those for five minutes. Exactly five minutes. Now we're going to take these tips and wash them with cold water. So carefully transferring them, we'll transfer five of these. across out of the acid and then we're going to wash them with cold water make sure they've washed the acid off to blot them dry. So we'll transfer them again onto some blotting paper. Very carefully. Be careful not to squash them too much, they'll be delicate. Nope. Then transfer the tips to microscope slides. Just that you do four of them. We did five in case we lost one, because they are easily lost. There we go. There's our four tips. And then we're going to stain those. And we're going to stain them using right now we're going to macerate the tip. I'll show you how to do one of these. To macerate, it's a short one, okay, we're going to squash it with a mounted needle. So you're breaking the cells open a bit. You should find it's quite soft now, because the hydrochloric acid will have broken the cell walls. So you're just squashing it with the mounted needle. Okay. Here we go. Now we stain using toluidine blue. That's this one, this one here. Please make sure you wear your safety glasses when handling toluidine blue. One drop on top. Now we stain each of our root tips and we'll stain them sequentially. So two minutes afterwards we're going to stain this one. So you can repair this one, etc. And you will end up with uh, four slides, each stained for different periods of time. So you'll stain them for um, so two minutes later you can stain the second one after another two minutes stain the third one and after another two minutes you can stain your fourth one and you will have a range of stain in staining times Leave the stain on 
for two minutes for the first one and then you need to cover slip. To cover slip, bring your cover slip in at an angle at 45 degrees and lower it gently onto the stain and then what you're going to do is we're going to compress this, spread, spread to spread the cells take an, another piece of filter paper I suggest that you fold this in half or blotting paper over the top and then press harder than you think should be possible so press down firmly and you should have spread it, you should see the cells have spread nicely hopefully into a nice single layer and you can repeat this process for the rest of your um, sections, rest of your cells. Examine your slide at low power. This is what you should see. You need to examine your cells carefully for evidence of mitosis. Look at the cells around the edges of your preparation. Choose a slide which is well stained. One of your four should be nicely stained. And look carefully for individual layers of cells. You make sure there are cells which were near the tip, the very tip of the, just behind the tip of the um, slide.